that heart disease is still the number one killer of women in America. Here are some fast facts for you from the American Heart Association. Cardiovascular disease kills one in three women. More than half of black women have some type of cardiovascular disease and more than 40% of Hispanic women over age 20 have cardiovascular disease. So let's talk about why this is happening. Okay, what puts you at high risk for heart disease? Here are some of those reasons. High blood pressure, smoking of course, poor nutrition and or access to proper food, not enough exercise, genetics, high cholesterol, type two diabetes. That's just to name a few. Now Lupe Barraza had a couple of those risk factors, type two diabetes and high blood pressure, but she never really connected that to heart problems specifically until a series of events in her family made her stop and entirely change her lifestyle and her family's lifestyle. The May after my mother had her stroke, my dad had a heart attack. And, you know, in that whole, in that entire year, he went from losing toes to on both feet to part of both feet to now, you know, he's lost a leg, you know, from the knee down. So, and that's all a result of, result of type being type two diabetic. So I saw that. I think that I have caught it and have started my habits early enough. Lupe has six children. She now exercises regularly, has cut back on sugar and excess carbs, and really has created a support system that is helping her to maintain a healthy lifestyle that is so important. Now, if you have type two diabetes, talk to your doctor about your risk for heart disease and stroke. And for more information, you can visit nodiabetesbyheart.org.